you're here. Hopefully you watched yesterday when I talked about how people currently view marketers. Today, I'll explain why. While the public's perception of marketers is largely unfair and unjustified, it's still there for a reason. Here's why I think that marketers aren't garnering the respect they deserve. For one, marketing is the most trackable and therefore damnable activity. Other than sales, marketing results are the most easily trackable components of a business. A business owner can look at a P&L and see the difference between revenue and the advertising budget. And while they shouldn't, they will make decisions based on that number. Even with the changes to privacy and tracking, there are about a million reports that can be generated on all marketing related platforms, from Google Analytics to Facebook ads to social media channels, subscribers, comments, likes, etc. With all this data, it's easy for people to blame marketers for all sales results, even if the actual outcome is related to product design, customer service, pricing, and a ton of other operational concerns. Secondly, marketing is complicated. Unsurprisingly, most people's idea of marketing comes from television, more specifically, the series Mad Men. A bunch of overconfident, chemically adled man children coming up with tricky phrases to dupe customers out of some cash. At least that's what cynics think. In reality, marketing is much more complicated than that. The funny part is that Mad Men actually gives an excellent view into marketing, but it's not obvious and only marketers will probably understand it. A key note in that regard is in the first episode when a new employee is walked through the agency and told that all the real money is made in the lowly and unassuming media buying department. But marketing is way more complicated than that. Today, marketers have to deal with more competition than ever before. They also have to deal with a constantly evolving set of legal, regulatory, and societal rules, and a changing and growing list of technology, platforms, and media types, some of which, like the metaverse, haven't even been embraced yet. These complications mean that marketing is even less understood than it has ever been in history, and with a lack of clarity has come a lack of understanding and appreciation. If everyone knew what was going on, we'd all start using the phrase, it's not marketing strategy, rather than it's not rocket science or it's not brain surgery. Maybe not, but you get the gist. Lastly, big tech has oversimplified marketing and made the misconception widespread through expensive advertising campaigns. You've probably seen tons of commercials from GoDaddy, Wix, Bluehost, and others that show how you can build a website or marketing campaign with a few simple clicks. This is wrong. I used to build websites for a living, and the misconception that building a website is easy made my job way harder. The same is true for advertising platforms that make running ads sound like a five-minute task that a five-year-old can do in their sleep. Millions upon millions of dollars have been spent by big tech companies to convince the masses that all aspects of digital marketing are cheap, easy, and stupidly simple. And they are, if you don't want to ROI on anything that you're doing. There you have it. Tomorrow I'll talk about how we can change this misconception using four important actions. 